Hopkins can bear it. Why exactly are you home anyway? What happened to med school? Answer me, young man. So this is how you're gonna be? Jude! Thank you for the consultation. What got into him? <sighs> the procedure might be explained in the medical files. If Dad won't help me, I'll do it myself. Better check the archives. Looking for this? I knew you wouldn't give up just because your dad turned you away. Thanks, Leia. Wow. My old man really is a genius. They sure didn't teach us techniques like this at med school. Apparently, it requires a special stone. The kind of stone isn't written here, though. Yeah... Dad took detailed notes of the entire procedure. As long as we have the device, we should be able to heal Mila. But is Mila up for it? I heard the last patient to undergo the procedure cried uncle after eight seconds. He chose to remain paralyzed rather than endure the treatment. It's that painful, huh? You know, maybe you should just forget about this. What if your friend goes through all that torture for nothing? It's worth the risk. I'm going to do it. If you say so. Well, you should check the box up there. What's in it? The Asperixis! Yeah. I found it after I started helping here, when I was cleaning up. Let's go to Mila's room. I want to try this. Oh, uh, wait! I'm coming too! What are you doing? Shh. We can't let my dad hear us. Why not? We're gonna use the Asperixis on you now. But your father just told me it was impossible. Leia, give me a hand. Uh, uh sure. Here, you'll want to lay down on your side.
feel anything? Any pain? No, nothing at all. My leg still won't budge either. Why isn't it working? I don't sense any mana in this stone. Your father said that an Asperixis needs a spirit fossil, or it won't work. A spirit fossil? Those things really exist? Oh, so the special stone mentioned in the medical files is a spirit fossil. Your father also said the fossil has to be used immediately after it's uncovered, or it loses its mana. Great. As if the procedure wasn't already tricky enough. Hold on. I swear I remember that they used to find spirit fossils down in the Felgana mine. Are you serious? Whoa, jeez, be quiet. It's just something my dad told me. Mila, it sounds like we need to take you out for some field medicine. That seems like a lot of work. You'll do that for me? Here. Thank you. Jude, can you help her into the wheelchair? What about you? I have to get stuff ready. I'll meet you at the edge of town. I haven't been back here in a while, but the town hasn't changed one bit. Pretty normal. What, that's it? That's all you have to say? You're always boring everyone with long-winded explanations, but when I ask a question, I get the cold shoulder. Come on, you're blowing things out of proportion. Listen, you're gonna talk and you're gonna tell me everything. You have 10 seconds. 10, nine, eight. Well, there was a nurse at the school named Prin who was always really nice to me. But on the day I went to see my professor, I got attacked by a girl in red clothes. So then, I couldn't go back to the school anymore. Although that did result in me meeting Mila. Oh, and in terms of other friends, I met this girl named Elise. Fine, I got it. Message received loud and clear. You met all sorts of other girls while you were away. Good job, Jude. I'm so happy for you. I see you haven't changed a bit. Thank you. 